so it's like okay today i have to make this video like for sure um hey guys welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to be talking about my testimony i will be sharing my walk with god with you guys um yeah i did not think i would be making this video but for some reason like i had another video in mind that i planned to do but for some reason like i just felt like, I don't know, but I just felt like this. You know when you just feel something on your heart and, like, you just just constantly, like, tugging at you? So, I just felt like uh, I needed to make this video because I felt like it would help somebody out there that is currently going through the same thing or has decided to follow God and have faith in Him. So, I i am raised up in i was raised up in a catholic christian household my parents are catholic i am catholic and we went to church on sundays we went to catechism we always prayed every night every morning for dinner for breakfast for lunch literally everything you can think about and that was just basically how it was and for me like i did not have a relationship with god i was just basically following in my parents shadows and i felt like i did not really understand his purpose in my life i had this discussion with my mom this holiday and i was telling her just naturally it doesn't necessarily mean that because your children because you are have that faith in god that your children necessarily have that faith in god just from them going to church or like doing certain things because you're asking them to they i just felt like just because you haven't really experienced it and i'm i'm not saying like i blame them for for any of that it's just like they're doing what they know how to do best how they know how like <laughs> if that makes sense how they know how to wait <laughs> they're doing what they know how to do how to do i'm not even going to try but you get what i mean and for me that felt like i did not i definitely did not have a relationship with god i just felt like i just knew like okay i had to go to church on sunday i can't do this i can't do that because the bible says this I felt like okay me going to church me going me doing this me doing that me taking the holy communion that was enough like i felt like that was enough at that point in time and basically that was the perception i had and i think where my shift started was when i came to where my shift in faith started was when i came to grenada and literally like my first year it was the hardest year like i don't know what it was but it was just too hard for me obviously when you get into university you would want to do everything everybody's doing like you would want to fit in you want to do like certain things and for me like after my first semester i just remember me saying like oh my god like i cannot even come and die like i cannot come and kill myself because my first semester was just okay i was just hanging right there and it was it was like but i'm praying but i'm going to church but i'm taking the holy communion i'm giving my tithes like i'm doing everything that i thought i was supposed to be doing but like then i still did not have that relationship with god so i did not understand and for me it felt like okay i was doing everything that was required of me or in my head it just registered like Oh yeah, I can do all of this because the fact that I am not breaking any rules in the Bible or as far as I am not sinning or like to me, that was not a sin. 
so it was just like okay as far as i'm not doing this or as far as i'm not doing that then i'm good but <laughs> But then I was still sinning and I felt like that was why God was punishing me. But, and after that happened, like, it was just like, okay, so if I'm doing all of this and I'm not, and this is still happening to me and this can still happen to me. I was angry at myself. I was angry with God. Like, I did not want to hear anything about him. I did not want to go to church. I did not want to do anything. Because when I stopped going to church, like, the people... I used to go to church with would be like um today like they would be like oh Chinasa you know going to church today and I'm like no I'm not going today I have so 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 and so like I was always bringing up excuses as to why I could not go to church just because I felt like I felt very angry I felt very like I felt like I did not need to be in the midst of God like, at this point god has abandoned me and it and after a while like after i stopped going to church rather like anytime i would go out it would just feel like i was sinning so if my friends were to be like yeah let's go to church or let's do this to me going back to church after going to a party and doing all the things that I had done, it was just like, okay, you just sinned and now you want to go into church. You think God is going to forgive you. Like all those type of things. So to me, that was how I felt. And I just did not feel like God loved me or like I needed to be in the presence of God or like he was going to help me at this point in time like i just felt i felt very lost that that's the word okay so fast forward to me finding the transformation church on youtube this year i think it was this year yeah but this year there was this particular video i watched and it just like that video spoke to me and it answered basically part of the questions that i had been looking for answers to and they literally like broke down some of the questions like broke it down so well and i was like oh my god and from there it was just like okay like i need to take a step back and like just reevaluate myself and just know where i am for me it was just like okay like i want to have this relationship with god like i want to be this close with god i didn't know what i was doing like i didn't know where to start from i didn't know what to do like i was just lost and i was still i was still trying to understand like who god was i was still trying to like know where to basically start on my journey with him watching that video i feel like it just ignited something in me and i was just like I want to have a relationship with God, like I want to know God more. And I would say me going home was just very needed because I think that was what God wanted. Like I think he wanted me to have that alone time. I would do certain things and I would just feel a certain type of way about it. Like. And to me, it was just crazy because it was like, okay, but you used to do this thing before, so why is it any different? And to me, like, I would just kick it at the back of my mind. Like, I would just be like, mm, it doesn't mean anything. But then I would go home and I would feel so empty or I would I would just start crying for no reason. And to me, like, it, don't, it did not make any sense. Like, I was just like, like, <laughs> why is this even happening? So, um, when I went home, I said to do a lot of things differently watching one of the videos that they had posted i think they posted it like some months back and i had just downloaded it and they had like this little prayer at the end of it and for some reason like i did like i just felt like oh i wasn't ready i was what's the point of me saying this prayer and then i go back to doing the same things i used to do so i just wrote it down somewhere Wrote it down somewhere and, and just one night me laying in bed listening to listening to gospel music and i just felt 
I don't know how to explain the feeling but like the same way I felt about making this video is the same way I felt that night and I was and it was just something like you need to you need to do it now you need to do it now after saying that prayer I knew there were like this time was different I knew there were certain things that I wasn't going to do I was just so confident I just made this video just to share my journey with you guys and everybody's testimony is different and I am nowhere near where I want to be but I thank God for where I am right now. Please subscribe and thank you guys for watching.